Another component that uses coolant is gonna be the air compressor. Now this, this is the air compressor that charges the air tanks for the air brake and it uses coolant to keep it cool during operation. It's basically like any other engine. It has a piston with a head and it uses coolant to cool the head off. So if you have a failure with your compressor, for example, if you have a cracked head on the compressor, uh, it's a possibility that compressor that compression that's actually made for the pressure for the air tanks can go into the cooling system and cause some extreme pressure. And usually that pressure is gonna be really quick. And the way that you can check this see if it's the compressor is what I've done here is I've taken off the the outlet of the compressor discharge line as you can see it's dry there's no coolant on that compressor discharge ship there also if you do have coolant coming out of there or in your tank that's gonna be an indication you have a bad compressor now there's one more test that we're gonna do to kind of really kind of pinpoint where this problem's coming from and one of this tests is called it's gonna be called combustion gas test so let's move over to that test next and see what we can find 